Hey, for me, it's only two choices. Either I'm brilliant or I'm a jackass. There's no other options. Either I'm brilliant or I am a jackass. I'm fine with either one. <clears throat> and you can put me in either category, but I will not go in any one of them outside of that. It's gonna be one of them two. Either I'm gonna be brilliant or I'm gonna be a jackass. So you can pick which definition you wanna choose. I'm fine with it either way. Because if I can put jackass in my own definition, that means anything that anybody says to me, I put it under that category, label it as disrespect as far as I'm concerned, and be mature about the situation, and then look at it in a different way and continue to move on. Because this enterprise that I'm creating, over 400 some videos at this point, I got over 12,000, or I'm knocking on 12,000 views at this point, so I'm starting to get excited. I'm starting to salivate at the mouth at the success that's occurring at this point. I'm starting to get more energetic, almost like feeding gasoline to a fire. I'm starting to be more empowered, and I'm starting to feel more of an influential and more confidence to speak to people and spread this whole concept of, of being baby Cupid and also baby Oprah and spreading this network and doing all this type of stuff. So I'm starting to get a lot of, I'm starting to get, it's starting to grow, and I'm starting to get on another level. Y'all see the hat, the G-A-W. I'm gonna do another one somewhat like this, but I'm gonna have, a, my logo is gonna be a little, bit, a little bit different. I'm gonna market those and they up for sale. So once I do that, y'all be supportive of yourself and get one on because it's gonna be a nice slick hat, same kind that Tiger Woods or somebody would wear, or 50 Cent probably. And don't be disrespecting me, 50 or nobody, from what I just said, because keep it all professional and keep it all on one level. Because remember, this whole world is designed for people to be respectful and show love to one another. So once that doesn't happen, then whatever happens after that, it happens. I'm either brilliant or I'm a jackass. So um, those are the only two definitions that I'm settling for. You say anything outside of that or whatever, I just put you into a category. And it won't even be verbally communicating. I can be in a, a coffee shop drinking a, a mocha or a latte or something like that, and you can say something to me and I'm gonna process the information. Or I'm gonna say something to you first probably because I'm usually the one who speaks first. So um, me having those country type roots, even though I'm from East Cleveland in the gut, in the urban area, I still am more polite and more respectful than most people that I've ever seen in my whole life. It's just the truth and I'm not gonna dance around it or sugarcoat it anymore um, I'm a communicating machine, and um, I'm showing love for people, and people don't always show love back. But with that being the reality of the situation, then the world deals with and get dealt whatever is dealt. I don't have anything to do with it, but I'm, the only thing I'm going to do is whenever I'm in your presence or ever get a chance to have dialogue with you, I'm going to be positive. That's all I'm going to do. So um, being respectful. So I'm going to tell you right now before we get off of this, I'm going with the definition of brilliant. Because I'm looking at what I'm doing like, wow, man, you are really brilliant, dude. I'm be honest with you, you know. And I'm putting this resume together, and as I'm looking at my own resume, I'm like, oh, my. No lies. No lies. It's all true. I just told myself a long time ago, I'm going to tell myself the truth. I'm not going to lie to me, and I'm not going to lie to um, my spiritual being. I'm not going to lie to me. So I told myself the truth a long time ago, and that's why some of this stuff is coming out now. It's a revelation and it's all beautiful. Man, I am brilliant. I am brilliant. So I, you put the jackass definition on there for my critics, the ones that don't like me for whatever reason that is, for the ones that don't speak, for the ones that choose to block me out and uh, treat me like some type of a stepchild as if I did something negative to you. I didn't do nothing to you. I'm not no I didn't molest you. I didn't do anything to you when you was a child. I got nothing to do with the fact that you got cheated on whether you've been married before, you've never been married, or you have desires to be married, if you've had relationships with men before and it didn't work out, I have nothing to do with that. So before you come anywhere close to me with that any negative energy, guys included, don't come to me with that muscle stuff or whatever like that because you're going to get dealt with. And that's the way life goes. So I'm telling you right now, for anybody that's listening to the sound of my voice, better quit playing them games. I'm brilliant.